Hey, what's up, guys? Um, this is like a technical clan battle thing, I suppose. It was like I, I was in a p public match and I found these guys and had my friends against their theirs and I mean it was a pretty good match, but I don't know I don't know if I'd call it a clan battle, but I mean we were facing full party against full party. But yeah, um for overall this was a pretty good match. It was a I mean, I, it was a while ago, so I don't quite remember exactly how it goes, but, um, we scraped them, pretty much. <laughs> now, um, I recently watched that Bla Black Ops 2 trailer, and it looks kind of weird. Like, at first I was thinking, oh, it's going to be horrible, but now that I've sat down and th thought about it, you know, I'm thinking he it might go some different ways, you know, since I heard they might be, they're going to be uh, rebuilding the multiplayer from the ground up. Then, it's gonna be, I I think it's gonna be great because that's what it needs. That's what Call of Duty needs. They've been using old, old uh, what should we call it? Graphic, whatever it's called. They be using old that engines, yes, old engines, and they just need to make a new one from the ground up instead of using the old ones. Because maybe, hopefully, a lot of the stuff that we hate. Is gonna be t are gonna be taken away finally, but I wouldn't have my hopes up because that's every year they take a little bit out, but you know not enough to make us happy. But yeah, also I saw horses <laughs> in, in the freaking trailer. I'm all one thing we get get freaking attack horses and just have them ram the shit out of everybody in the map. <laughs> like let me know, l guys. Let me know. Like if if that would be a really cool kill streak, just having horses running around ramming the shit out of everybody. Everybody, that'd be kind of OP. Think about it. <laughs> Way better than the attack dogs. But yeah. Also saw that little quadrator helicopter thing. Hope you get. Yeah, hope you get to control that in like multiplayer, cause that'd be pretty sick. Cause the gunship was disappointing. I mean, thought the idea of it was good, but like, like it wasn't good at all. Like, I'd prefer the chopper gunner because I don't know. It's like it, it didn't feel like it worked properly to the best extent possible, you know. And of course, by gunship, I'm talking about Black Ops. If you don't already know, but yeah, I'm also thinking they're gonna have to fix. Not fix, uh, put in some new ways of prestiging or something, or like new achievements of prestiging. I'm hoping they can put something like, I don't know, like, like a new weapon that you can only unlock through prestiging. Or like, I don't know, just, that's, that's all I have to offer, but. If, uh, you guys should let me know what you guys want to see in Black Ops. So, uh, as if it matters, but you know, I just want to know your opinion. Yeah. I, I also saw the MP7 in another screenshot of Black Ops too. It was actually it, I saw the um, MP7 in there. Yeah, I said that already. Yeah. But yeah. Um, it looks almost the same as the one in Modern Warfare 3, but it, it's a little bit changed. But I guess there's gonna be a lot of old old weapons from Modern Warfare and all the other stuff coming back to Black Ops 2. So I guess because people love franchise guns, and by franchise guns I mean guns that everybody knows already, like the UMP. They had to bring it back into Modern Warfare 3 because a lot of people loved it in Modern Warfare 2. <laughs> they di they didn't want to just leave it alone out there. And also another another great example, the AK-47. They bring it back in every single Call of Duty, Call of Duty 4, not or War, that War, because you know it's not even available in that time. But you know, um, Modern Warfare 2, Black Ops, Modern Warfare 3. So, you know, let's see what other franchise guns they can have out there. See, you see, right here we're doubling their score, and. I think they were talking trash before this, and they just got scraped. <laughs> I, I just love catching people through this tube, because they, they always feel like they have an obligation to go through that 
tube and when it's the most dangerous thing to go through in this game. Well, in this map, of course. It's the most concentrated area, I suppose. I tried sabotage spawn trapping, uh, I think yesterday or two days ago, but it was kind of weird. And we ended up losing because we didn't do it right, but I don't know, it was boring, so I don't think I'm going to try that again. It was, it was feeling like, like pretty much the, the spawn traps and black ops and demolition, which are pretty boring. Getting, they got boring to me after a while. And I just, like, midway through Black Ops, I started playing Domination more and shit. <laughs> and I got most of my kills on Domination, thank God. <laughs> but a lot of it is also Demolition. Which I, I don't seem to play anymore on Modern Warfare 3, but I still have, like, a sense of, like, a, a knowing of how to play it. <laughs> but, yeah. Um... If you guys have heard anything about Black Ops that uh, Black Ops 2 that I haven't mentioned here and that you think I might not know, you guys should post a comment below and definitely let me know because I'd love to know any uh, any uh, new news about Black Ops 2 because <laughs> I am definitely buying that game. Like if I can when I get it, because I'm trying to get it for the if it comes out for the Vita, I'll try to make a video of it like that. But it's gonna be weird, but I'll try. I'm pretty sure some of you guys are going to be wondering how it's going to look on the Vita, how it's going to play. And I'm also hoping it's going to be like some PS3 Vita connectivity, because I think that would be great. Like, j just so you could play wh wherever you want, whenever you want, against people playing at home on their PS3s. Uh, that would be good, but it might feel a little weird, because the analog sticks are very, really short. You'd need, like, control freaks for, like, <laughs> Vita. Which would be kind of weird. Um, and uh, the sensitivity would also have to be fixed up a little bit. But I think it could be done. I don't know how, but I think it could be done. So, um, have you guys any games that you want me to play? I'll, d I'll I mean, I'm open to anything. I'll do walkthroughs and whatnot, and how tos and all that stuff. Also play the bass and the drums. And also another fun fact that you guys that I don't think you guys know about me. I am a cancer survivor. I had cancer when I was nine, got rid of it when I was ten, and been good ever since. But I thought you guys should know. Cause uh I don't know. I, I guess you guys be interested. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm I'm a cancer survivor call of duty player. Yeah. Oh, and you see Chaos Kill it right there. It's my freaking best friend to play on, play on with uh, Call of Duty. He's freaking awesome. He's 12 years old, and he is probably better than me. But, you know, and and most people just talk trash because he, he, they call him a squeaker or whatnot, but he ends up fucking shutting them down. If, if you play with him, you'd know why. <laughs> so you see here, we're pretty much doubling this score right here. I think, well, it's about to end, yeah. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, any comments would be great. Suggestions, subscribe and whatnot, like, and enjoy. I mean, I enjoy. Peace. <laughs>